We're gathered here today to join together this man and this woman in matrimony. I've disappeared, you know just where to look, you know just where to look. And you, you have a heart of gold. To the woman I'm so glad I'm marrying. I promise to always love you, to support you in everything you do, and to make you the happiest woman ever. You're incredible, and I love you so much. And most importantly, I promise to love you for all of my life. With all of my love, Anthony. For those that don't know me, my name is Rachel, and I am fortunate enough to call Lauren my cousin, and in some ways, a second sister. Even though we grew up over 2,000 miles apart, we have always been very close. Whenever I think of Lauren, I think of someone who has the strength to step up to the plate and give support when someone close to her is going through a really rough time. I've learned this is a very actually rare quality to have in somebody. A lot of my life is about friendships and relationships and being there for people. And since we met, it's never been anything short of that. I've always been there when I needed somebody to talk to. You're always the first one I want to text when something exciting happens. And I can't thank you enough. Anthony, I've had butterflies dreaming about today. I have waited to marry my best friend, and I cannot believe that day is here. I was always told to marry the man who makes me smile, and the man who will love me forever. I have found that man in you. I have loved you for 1,273 days. Today is day one of our life together as husband and wife. Always a momentous occasion to be able to say you get to see one of your best friends get married. Fortunate for me, I get to see both. I have two of my best friends that found each other through thick and thin, ups, downs, and from day one, it's been nothing but magic. The secret, I, in my opinion, of a, of a marriage is making your partner's goals come true, not making your own goals come true. Lauren, Anthony, you've got to dance like nobody's watching. Love like you'll never be hurt. And live like it's heaven on earth. These two have this crazy love for Harry Potter. Let's say uh, Nostradamus or Espillianus or whatever spell it is for love eternally to Mr. and Mrs. Gripaldi. As your wife, I promise to stand by you, love you unconditionally, encourage you, and honor you as my husband. I promise to always make you laugh and smile, and I promise I'll love you for an infinite number of days until death do us part, always and forever. Lauren, Krista, I love you with all of my heart, forever and always, my life, my love, my wife. Therefore, I am honored and proud to pronounce you 
husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. I do, I do, I do.